Saturday morning with us. This is a fantastic turnout. Being able to come out in, in community, it's just really gratifying to see the turnout, to see the enthusiasm for the cause of protecting our public lands, our trails, and our rivers together. So this is really great. It's definitely a group effort. Well, United by Blue is here in partnership with Public Lands, Friends of the Riverfront, and Allegheny Clean Ways to clean up the Three Rivers Heritage Trail and the river banks of the Ohio River. We're inviting the local community to come out. Allegheny Clean Ways and Friends of the Riverfront have some pretty dedicated groups of volunteers that come out often. One of the staffers from Allegheny Cleanways, Danny, has a specially outfitted cargo bike, which is used to haul trash from tough to access places back to a place where we can responsibly dispose of it. This is my person-powered dump truck. It's an electric assist cargo bike. It can handle up to 400 pounds of garbage in person at a time. It's pretty heavy duty, it's a lot of fun. It makes hauling the trash around fun. <laughs> We have a pretty strong community of cyclist volunteers. It, it makes sense to me, you know, if you spend time outdoors, you you see the stuff more, you care about it more, and you wanna you wanna take part in making things better. We're also trying to take our volunteerism a step further by collecting data on the trash that we're collecting today. That can inform things like plastic bag taxes, straw bans. Not only can we clean up the trash that we're finding here today, but we can help turn off the faucet, so to speak, later on by helping there be policies that make it so there's less trash out here to clean up in the future. Pittsburgh really brought the good energy and the good vibes. This is by far our largest cleanup that we've had since the pandemic began. Today is actually part of a two-week campaign that we're calling Blue Friday 2021. United by Blue started that because they wanted, instead of Black Friday being about buying, they wanted to turn it to Blue Friday being about giving and giving back to the waterways. We want the holidays to be more than about just buying gifts. For people, we want it to be about coming together with others. That's new. Businesses didn't used to always be a part of this type of work. And it's really special when multiple for-profits come together around a cause that has nothing to do with business and has everything to do with the environment and society and making a difference. This trail is a really important trail for a lot of people in the area. So being able to come together and clean up the trash that's collected here is really important. It's so heartwarming to be able to get back into these types of events after a long year and a half of not being able to host this type of impact or host this type of project. So we're excited to get into 2022, hopefully a bright future for cleanups ahead and have many more events like these. We can't wait to see you at the next one.